All right, YouTube, what is going on? It is, in fact, your boy Wingstop. I'll be back at you guys today with another video on today's video. I'm pretty excited about because this is a shoe I've been wanting to try. And I recently just picked up picked them up this past week. I believe these came out Thursday. And I did pick them up from a local boutique, boutique called St. Alfred. Sorry for the mispronunciation. I'm just so excited to get into these. But yeah, St. Alfred is a store in Chicago, and that's where I picked these beautiful shoes up from they're technically not really shoes but right now in quarantine these are like the perfect shoes i'm sure you guys can probably guess these are easy slides but before we get into them please hit that like subscribe and feel free to follow me on instagram below to see how i style these beautiful slides so as i mentioned i bought them from st alfred online they came out thursday and the good thing about buying them from a local chicago spot is that they did get to me uh, relatively quickly i ordered them thursday came here today saturday so i'm filming this on saturday so you see the black uh, packaging that came in the uh, black shopping bag and then they did come with two stickers so this is actually our first time purchasing from st alfred but obviously totally legit one of the most like respected boutiques in the united states when it comes to like streetwear sneakers etc but anyways like i mentioned easy slide now those come in this brown adidas easy box same box as the 350 700 500 etc but it is smaller because obviously they're just sandals so yeah um i'll just pull it out for you guys so same standard paper that you will see and then the colorway is earth brown earth brown earth brown size 11 easy slide now let's get into the slides because this is what everyone wants to see and bang bang here they are the earth brown easy slides now the colorway to me looks like mocha like a cappuccino that you would get like at starbucks that's the exact colorway i thought of when i saw these there's really not much to these honestly it's one constructed it's one piece upper um, they feel pretty good the plasticky i believe they have the eva foam in there which is the same foam they put in the 700 v3s which i struck out on still a little salty about that but it is what it is so I feel like they are going to be pretty comfortable. I mean, I just put them on to wear them around the house. I will hit you guys with the on foot so you guys can see what they look like. And the price point on these is one of the main reasons why I wanted to try these and pick these up because they're only $55. Um, I was really surprised because usually for a Yeezy slide, I figured they would probably charge a hundred for these. Like, it wouldn't surprise me at all if they did charge a hundred. But I'm happy these were only $55 so people who want to just try them it won't really be like hard on your pockets if you want to just try these out if you don't like them you could probably get rid of them for retail or even a little bit over i don't think they're going for too much over retail they did sell out though so i remember the first time they came out uh they kind of sat and then this time like i guess there was a new hype wave it must have been that gq article or whatever because yeah, it was actually wearing them in the GQ article and one of the fits they like photographed and a black pair which hasn't been released. But anyways, um, getting back into the slide, there's not really too much branding on these. It just has an Adidas logo. It's got this rigid um, bottom. And then on the inside, underneath the like covering or whatever you want to say, it. I'm not an expert when it comes to reviewing slides, but it does have a little easy branding in there. And then to end the video, let's just go into sizing. So it's sizing on these. I did watch a few videos um, before I made the purchase. And people told me just to go with my 350 V2 size. So that's what I went with. Now, my true size is 10 and a half. These don't come in half sizes, by the way. And my 350 V2 size is 11. So I just went with 11. And I can tell you right off the bat, they fit perfectly. So if they do have a, so if you do have 350s and you're looking to buy these, just go with that size. If you don't have any 350s just go up half a size so if you're like a 10 and a half go up to 11 but if you're a 10 i would just stick with the 10 if that makes sense but if you're like a half size like if you're at a nine and a half go up to 10 if that makes sense hopefully that will clear it up for some people but yeah that's like pretty much my review i'm about to throw these on feet give you guys some on feet looks you guys determine if you want to try these out or not um if you did miss out i'm sure these will be restocking during the summer it's kind of weird they first dropped in december which is who's wearing slides in december unless you live in like florida but i do see these restocking over the summer so if you don't want to pay the resale i don't even know what the resale is but i would just recommend waiting they i see these definitely just coming back during the summer because obviously everyone wants to wear slides during the summer i could see these being very popular amongst yeezy enthusiasts and just fashion enthusiasts whatever i think a lot of people were sleeping on these but now everyone is like kind of coming around. It's kind of like when the 700 Wave Runner dropped. 
everyone was like, nah, like those are trash. Same thing with these, but then people like come around, people keep seeing them on feet and they're just like, okay, I was wrong about those. So yeah, um, that's gonna pretty much do my review. I mean, there's not really too much to say. Like I said about the throw these on feet, I'm about to dip out of here. Hope you guys have a great weekend. Hope you guys are staying safe and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.